subscribe to masterminds and press on bell icon to be the first to watch every video Hey what is up guys this is Sai from Masterminds and uh, today in this video I will be teaching you how to speed up your android smartphone without rooting without changing your rom or without putting custom rom without increasing nasty things or without downloading or installing exposed frameworks in your android smartphone this is very simple all you have to go is to go to settings and please do watch this video up to last so that you can able to clearly understand what are the steps that I am doing and uh, please do this settings that i am right now doing this is experimentally done and it has been proven that it does increases the speed so go to about phone in that for me devices tap five times for in me version you can see no need you are already a developer because i have i already activated the developer option if you don't know how to become a developer how to open developer option in your smartphone just click on the link uh, just search on my videos you will see that five hidden menus in android smartphone you can use that video and go through if you are using any other smartphone click on built number five times you will become a developer if that also doesn't work click randomly on any uh, every option so that it will activate if you are using any other smartphones except me device you the developer option will be available above uh, above the about phone tab if you're using me devices i'm using i'm currently using me 4i so i will be having the developer option below the accessibility settings and navigate to developer options this option will be turned off when uh, by default you have to turn it on and click on ok so that you can able to edit the speed of your android smartphone after doing that you can see uh, tap called drawing in that just click on windows animation scale and set as 0.5x in transaction also set as 0.5x and in animation duration scale set as 0.5x after that navigate to the last in the app section you can see and uh, categories called background process limit in that you have to select the process depending upon the social media app that you that you want to currently running on your background i'm using four apps like youtube facebook and whatsapp and what do i use instagram so at most four process i need background runningly if you're using just two just select on two don't select no background process which means it doesn't run any of the apps in background and at, at most two process is mandatory at most 4 is optional and standard limit is the default option that is given in the android smartphone and after this just restart your smartphone you will see the difference before and after and if you doesn't see any improvement in your android smartphone just go to the same developer option and check whether the settings has been in the same setting like the animation scale is in 0.5x or it has been changed so you have to check that and after that the second step is to clear the catchy of your android apps in me devices there is an app called security app so it does has a default security app which has a default cleaner which will clean the catchy of the of my smartphone and if you are using any other smartphone just download ccleaner or any other cleaning app which will clear your android smartphone don't download ram boosters or any other any other stuff cause it is those are memory eaters which will directly running your background so it does eat your memory and reduces the performance of your android smartphone i um, the, this is a proof that you can see the opening and closing of my smartphone has a difference before and after doing the settings i hope you all like this video please do hit like and do subscribe guys share this video to every friend those who are having low budget or minimum spec phone like me you and so other guys so share this video
please do hit like do subscribe guys this is sayed from masterminds i will see you on my next video bye guys